Today I'm in Fort Worth, Texas, AKA Cowtown, also known as Funky Town. Fort Worth is one of the fastest growing cities in the country. It's rich in culture and it has a lot to offer its residents. So if you want to know everything there is to know about living, working and playing in the city of Fort Worth, then this video is absolutely for you. Guys, if you're new to the channel, my name is Richard Soto with VIP Realty, a local real estate broker right here in the Fort Worth Dallas Metroplex. And if you're new to the channel, please make sure you hit that subscribe button as we do weekly videos discussing what it's like to live, work, and play right here in the Dallas Fort Worth Metroplex. As we discussed in this video, we're going to discuss why Fort Worth is such a popular place for residents relocating to the Lone Star State to call home. Fort Worth has a lot to offer. It's rich in culture. It has a lot of nice, friendly people that offer Southern hospitality. It's the fifth largest city in the state of Texas with a population of about 975,000 residents. People on a daily basis are moving to Cowtown. And in this video, we're going to cover all the reasons why Fort Worth, Texas is such a popular destination. The city of Fort Worth is founded in North Central Texas and is one of the fastest growing cities in the United States. With a total population of about 975,000 people, Fort Worth is the fifth largest city in the state of Texas. Fort Worth has a vibrant downtown area and an exciting city center. Fort Worth is known as one of the best places to live in Texas for its job market, culture, and Southern hospitality, and many young professionals and families are relocating to the area. As you're about to see, Fort Worth is a city all of its own with plenty to offer those moving to Texas. Fort Worth is a great place to live for many reasons. It's a convenient, affordable city with low cost of living and a diverse economy. It's also friendly, down to earth people, and there's always something to do, so let's get into it. Okay guys, let's discuss why Fort Worth is such a popular place for families and singles alike to call home. And probably the number one reason is going to be the cost of living. Everything in Fort Worth is going to be very reasonably priced. As a matter of fact, it's much lower than the majority of other large cities across the country. Fort Worth is going to offer a relatively low cost of living compared to other major cities in the United States. Housing, transportation, and everyday expenses are generally more affordable, allowing residents to stretch their budgets further. AreaVibes.com rates Fort Worth 4% less expensive than the national average. Fort Worth and Dallas are commonly linked together, but they are very different and we see the difference with the cost of living. The cost of living in Fort Worth is 19% cheaper than living in Dallas. According to an expat website, a full price comparison shows food is 24% lower, housing is 26% lower, and transportation is 20% lower than compared to Dallas. So anytime anyone mentions Dallas, they're going to think about Fort Worth. And if you mention Fort Worth, you have to think about Dallas. There are two cities that are always going to be compared. And quite frankly, guys, most of the time, if you prefer to live in Dallas, you're not going to like Fort Worth. And if you enjoy the lifestyle of Fort Worth, you're definitely not going to enjoy the vibe of Dallas. Saying that the biggest difference between the cities besides the vibe is going to be the cost of living on a day-to-day -day basis, whether you're looking to purchase or lease a home or condo or an apartment, it doesn't matter. You can definitely get much more bang for your buck if you reside in Tarrant County in the city of Fort Worth. Whew. It is hot, guys. It's July in Fort Worth, Texas. And if you watch any of my videos, not that it's a cons video, Fort Worth gets extremely hot and humid and it's that time of the year. So I came in to this awesome hat store that I've never visited. As I was walking down Houston Street, I saw an awesome sign, Peter's Brothers. So I decided to come in, one, really to get out of the heat. I'm not going to lie to you guys. But two, these are awesome custom-made cowboy hats. We just met a gentleman 
he just left. I should have interviewed him. He has been waiting on a custom hat for two years. Guys, that is, that's crazy. However, if you want some of the best custom made hats, visit this location right off of Houston Street. I'm gonna browse the store and see what looks good on me. However, guys, listen, look at my shoes. Okay, paying down to the shoes. You know, I am not the cowboy wearing type of guy. However, let's see. Let's see what happens. Maybe I'll order myself a custom cowboy hat. And if you're gonna reside in the city of Fort Worth, Texas, in Tarrant County, you might wanna add that to your wardrobe. Okay, guys, let's go with option one. Let me see. <laughs> Maybe if I tilt it sideways, I don't know. Let, let's, let's try something else, guys. This is, uh, you know, let's go with the brown hat, guys. This is uh, a collection from this country singer here. You know, let's see what this looks like. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, <laughs> we're working our way, guys. You know, let's get a little bit better. I always like to wear black, okay? If I'm not in white, I like to wear a black tee, so this would match my outfits perfectly when I'm out on the town. A little bit big. <laughs> Let's see how this looks. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that's, that's just not gonna work, okay? I'm sorry, guys. Maybe if we go with brown. This is a different type of hat. I don't know what this would be called. How's that look? <laughs> oh my God. Okay, guys, I'm just... Okay, so obviously we've come to the conclusion that I cannot pull off a cowboy hat, which I already knew that before I even tried them on. I'm more of a baseball cap type of guy, but who knows? I might be able to pull this off with my cigar bottle of cab. Let's see. Uh, <laughs> unless I'm moving to Florida and I'm going to retire, uh, this ain't going to... Guys, listen, okay? If you reside in Fort Worth, I highly recommend you get a cowboy hat. Obviously, the hats that are in stock are not for me. That's why my friend back here can build you a custom cowboy hat. I just left Peter Brothers right in front of me. Those hats were absolutely amazing. And guys, you don't even want to know the prices. The prices start at, I think he said 400 and go up to $6,000 if you want some chinchilla. Okay, you can get a chanchilla custom cowboy hat. I believe he also stated that beaver was like the Rolex of cowboy hats. Uh, guys, I couldn't pull it off, let's just keep it real. But one thing I did notice as I was walking out is I'm sweating profusely, guys. I'm glistening, okay? It is hot in Fort Worth, Texas. Let me tell you that right now. The building right behind me reminds me of when we visited New York, and I believe it's called the Flatiron Building, if I'm not mistaken, but it looks very similar to the building in New York City. Just wanted to point that out. And talking about New York City, Fort Worth offers exceptional public transportation. That's one. That's two. And let's go ahead and make it three, guys. Check out that guy. I should put my big mug on there. VIP Realty Richard Soto Real Estate Extraordinaire. Now let's keep it moving, guys. I gotta go find an iced white chocolate mocha because I need something cool to drink. Okay guys, let's move on to the next item and that's going to be outdoor recreation. As you can see the kids behind me having a blast in Sundance Square in downtown Fort Worth on a beautiful, very hot, humid, sunny day. I am literally considering jumping into that water. It is so freaking hot. However, I'm not gonna complain. It's still a beautiful day in Tarrant County. There is going to be numerous parks, hiking trails, biking trails. So if you enjoy the outdoors as much as I do, you'll love residing in the city of Fort Worth. The city is located near the beautiful Trinity River, which offers opportunities for hiking, biking, kayaking, and other outdoor activities. Residents can also enjoy nearby lakes such as Eagle Mountain Lake and Lake Worth for boating, fishing, and camping. I don't know about you, but I'm loving the city of Fort Worth. And one of the other reasons why Fort Worth is so popular and so many families across the country 
and around the world are moving to the city of Fort Worth is because of the Southern hospitality. People in the city of Fort Worth are very welcoming. They're inclusive. So if you have a hard time finding friends, <laughs> Fort Worth is going to be a great city, a great community, especially if you have kids and you want to raise a family. Fort Worth is going to have some of the nicest people in the entire country. The city has a strong sense of Southern hospitality where people are generally polite and helpful. If you're looking for friendly down to earth people, you'll find them in Fort Worth. Travel and leisure rank Fort Worth in its top 10 of the nation's friendliest cities. Meanwhile, nearby Dallas was one of the rudest. The city has a small town feel, even though it's a big city and people are quick to strike up a conversation. You'll find that Fort Worthites are proud of their city and more than happy to share their favorite things about it with newcomers. Okay guys, forget the chinchilla hat the beaver hat, snakeskin hat, whatever the case might be, I just found the hat that's Texas sized so I can block out the Texas rays upon my face. Actually, it's gonna cover my whole body. Check out this hat, it's massive. Okay, everyone, let's move on to the next topic, and that is going to be public education. And what can I tell you? The Fort Worth ISD is definitely not one of the top premier independent school districts in North Texas. As a matter of fact, it's sorely lacking. However, there is light at the end of the tunnel. While the Fort Worth ISD is not ranked very favorably, there are several top-notch public schools in the city. And it's worth mentioning that Fort Worth is served by several highly regarded educational institutions, including Texas Christian University, the University of North Texas Health Science Center, and Texas Westland University. TCU students can also finish their medical degrees at the Fort Worth School of Medicine. So the good thing in regards to living right here in Fort Worth is higher education is going to be premier in regards to North Texas. However, the public ISD, brutally honest as I always am, is going to be sorely lacking. However, you could always consider a charter school, maybe a suburb like South Lake Colleyville. There's always going to be options. However, do your research, especially if you have kids and you're like myself, where I refuse to pay for private school, I would definitely make sure that my kids are going to be zoned for an exceptional public ISD. However, guys, you have a friend in Fort Worth, Texas, and we're going to assist you locate the perfect home in an exceptional school district if you have children and if that's of top priority. Okay, everyone, let's move on to the next topic. As I'm being blinded by my shoes, the sweet lady at the cowboy hat place mentioned that these were the brightest shoes she's ever seen. I said, ma'am, this is mild. I have some bright yellow shoes, big bird mode at home. I don't only like to be heard, I like to be seen as well. She cracked up, hopefully I made her day. Very nice, sweet lady. Anyway, let's move on to the next topic and that's going to be cultural diversity. If you like to live in a diverse city, Fort Worth, and quite frankly, all of North Texas is going to be a great and ideal place to call home. As I'm walking around Sundance Square, I've already heard Mandarin, Spanish, there are people from around the world that not only reside in Fort Worth, but it's also a very popular tourist destination as well. Okay, let's move on to jobs and the economy. And if you reside in the city of Fort Worth, you're going to have a plethora of different job options, whether it's entertainment, aerospace, biotech, healthcare, endless number of jobs. Fort Worth, after all, is a major city, and as we stated earlier, the fifth largest city in the state of Texas. So if you're looking for employment and you're not finding employment in the city of Fort Worth, you're just not looking hard enough. Fort Worth is known for its diverse economy, which includes sectors such as aerospace and defense, manufacturing, healthcare, transportation, and logistics. It is home to several major corporations and has a strong presence in the energy sector. In 2022, WalletHub.com named Fort Worth in its top 20 best large cities to start a business. The Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex is home to an abundance of Fortune 500 companies, ranking fourth highest in the United States. 
Fort Worth's unemployment rate is also lower than the national average at only 3.6% and has seen the job market increase by 27 in the past year with significant projections for future job growth over the next decade. So as you can see, there's going to be plenty of job opportunities right here in the city of Fort Worth. However, if for some reason you just can't find a job, okay, Dallas, Texas is only 30 minutes away, which is another major power hub right here in North Texas. Okay, let's move on to the next topic, and that's going to be things to do in entertainment. Whether you're single and ready to mingle, or maybe you have a family and you want to spend some family time during the week or the weekend, there is going to be an endless amount of things to do right here in the city of Fort Worth. Let's go down the list and cover some of the things that you can take advantage of right here within the city. You can visit places like the Cultural District, Starkyard's National Historic District, Sundance Square, outdoor recreation activities such as boating, kayaking, hiking, biking. You can visit the Fort Worth Zoo, which is absolutely one of my favorite zoos in the world. I would consider it number two to San Diego. Or you can hit up the nightlife on West 7th Street, and there's also community events year-round that you can partake in. Guys, the great thing about being right here in downtown Fort Worth is that there's going to be numerous dining options. Whatever cuisine it is that you're looking for, you can find it right here in Sundance Square. Obviously, you know I'm a big Mexican food fan, so I ended up at Mi Cocina, as I already know what to expect. I'm not that hungry. However, it is extremely hot and humid outside, and I love their mojitos. So if you enjoy a nice mojito, or maybe you want a mumbo taxi, Mi Cocina is the place for you to visit. So if you're in downtown Fort Worth, definitely check it out. They do have some great drinks. Known for both a vibrant contemporary city while still living up its Cowtown reputation, Fort Worth offers the best of both worlds. And there's always something to do. Fort Worth is known as the city of cowboys and culture, and that unique blend of Western heritage and urban sophistication is evident throughout the city. Guys, I hope you enjoyed hanging out in Fort Worth, Texas with me today. If you're thinking about moving to Fort Worth throughout Tarrant County, Dallas, Houston, Austin, San Antonio, Midland, throughout the state of Texas, we have offices in every major city. We would be honored and we would love to assist you with your next real estate transaction. Whether you're looking to purchase or lease, you have a friend in the Lone Star State, Richard Soto, VIP Realty. Guys, for now, I'm about to go get myself an ice cold margarita. So I will see you on the next video.